afternoon, YouTubers. It is 4.36 p.m. on Thursday, the 21st, 2013. And we are going to continue with Revelations Chapter 5 from the Amplified Bible. And I saw laying on the open hand of him who was seated on the throne a scroll book written within and on the back, closed and sealed with seven seals, closed and sealed with seven seals, too. And I saw a strong angel announcing in a loud voice, Who is worthy to open the scroll, and who is entitled and deserves and is morally fit to break its seals? And no one in heaven or on earth or under the earth in the realms of the dead, Hades, was able to open the scroll or to take a single look at its contents. And I wept audibly and bitterly because no one was found fit to open the scroll or to inspect it. Five, then one of the elders of the heavenly Sanhedrin said to me, Stop weeping. See, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the root source of David, has won, has overcome and conquered. He can open the scroll and break its seven seals. Six, and there between the throne and the four living creatures beings among the elders of the heavenly Sanhedrin, Sanhedrin, I saw a lamb standing as though it had been slain, with seven horns and with seven eyes, which are the seven spirits of God, the sevenfold heavenly spirit, who had been sent on duty far and wide into all the earth. Seven. He then went and took the scroll from the right hand of him who sat on the throne. Eight. And when he had taken the scroll, the four living creatures and the twenty-four elders of the heavenly Sanhedrin prostate themselves before the Lamb. Each was holding a heart, lute, or guitar, and they had golden bowls filled with incense, fragrance, spices, and gums for burning, which are the prayers of God's people, the saints. Nine, and now they sing a new song, saying, You are worthy to take the scroll and to break the seals that are in it, for you were slain, sacrifice. And with your blood you purchased men unto God from every tribe and language and people and nations. 10. And you have made them a kingdom royal race, and a priest to our God, and they shall reign as kings over the earth. 11. Then I looked, and I heard the voices of many angels on every side of the throne, and of the living creatures, and the elders of the heavenly Sanhedrin, and the numbered 10,000 times 10,000 and thousands of thousands. 12. Saying in a loud voice, deserving in the Lamb, deserving is the Lamb, who was sacrificed to receive all the powers and riches and wisdom and might and honor and majesty, glory, splendor, and blessing. 13. And I heard every created thing in heaven and on earth and under the earth and Hades, the place of departed soul spirits, and on the sea and all that is in it, crying out loud to him who is seated on the throne and to the Lamb be ascribed the blessing and the honor and the majesty, glory, splendor, and the power, might, and dominion forever and ever through the et eternities of the eternities. 14. Then the living creature being said, Amen, so be it, and the elders of the he heavenly Sanhedrin prostate themselves and worshiped him who lives forever and ever. And that concludes Revelations chapter 5 from the Amplified Bible. <sighs> to read it, to feel it, to understand it. Oh, it's so spiritual. I hope you guys are receiving the same blessing just listening to it. I love you guys, and I shall return with Revelation chapter 6 from the Amplified Version. Love you, my brothers and sisters. May peace be in you, and I pray for God's perfect, perfect, bless, God's perfect will for you all. I'm so overwhelmed I can't even speak. <laughs>